Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Jocelyn Lovely Tarot. So good to see you guys here today. This reading is going to be for my fire signs. I don't know, something just told me to put fire signs. Uh, if you guys resonate with the video, like, share, and subscribe. If you guys want a personal reading, hit me up at jocelynlovely84 at gmail. My email is also on the link, okay? All right, guys, so we're starting off with the beautiful four of pentacles energy. I mean, five of pentacles energy. Look at this beautiful card. For some of you guys, this is a post. You, this is like a signpost, uh, a, a place where a little pit stop. Some of you guys were not able to see clearly. You can't see the road ahead, but then you spark up this light. This light comes into view. Maybe for some of you guys, it's perspective. For some of you guys, you left uh, your friends behind. It's almost as if you sacrificed the things you love the most, like playtime, friends, uh, family. You sacrificed everything just to work. So you're spending this whole time working, whether that's your business, that's work, or you're saving for, for whatever it is that you're investing in, you put that work in and then you just uh, have been doing this for months, maybe a year, and now you guys take a second to really breathe and you're reflecting back, right? Because it's the five of, 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 of pentacles, this person, it's, it's sometimes it could be a person that's left out in the cold or feeling like they're left behind or they're alone or isolated, but, but you're realizing why you did it, right? It's almost as if you're reflecting back and saying, damn, I don't play anymore. I don't have fun anymore. And it's like, oh, I know why. Because I'm working. Damn, I can't believe. And some of you guys are saying, I can't believe I let everything go and everything behind just to be here. Putting in all this work and not knowing if there's going to be great results or not, right? Because all you do, all, at the time, it all seemed worth it. This this sacrifice was worth it. It's the sacrifice you were willing to make again and again just to make sure that um, because you knew something would come out of it one day. There was never a guarantee, but you thought or you wanted something good to come out of it, right? The divine was also uh, urging you to do this. The divine was telling you there's something that's going to come out of it, right? So that's that right there. Uh, for some of you guys, you get this Knight of Wands energy, right? This fiery, beautiful, fast-moving energy. So this is the sparking of a light, right? It's sending a signal. For some of you guys, you were sending a smoke signal because you were feeling left out in the cold, hoping somebody would reach out to the signal or hoping the divine would hear the signal of yours, right? For some of you guys, this fast movement, you guys have been working steadily so hard because we're talking about pentacles and, and knight of wand. You've been working so hard on your passions, working tirelessly, nobody understanding how bad you wanted this for yourself because there was nothing else out there for you following your dreams your passions because you knew it would be worth it one day right that was confirmation i don't know if you guys heard that and then you get this knight of cups energy look at the boldness from this beautiful cup you got two knights knight of wands knight of cups it's a, a messenger it's a it's not just a messenger but it's 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 all about emotions the things that drive you the things that that hold strong strong emotions right it implicates strong emotions whatever it is whether that's passion project people places or things look at the boldness from this this cup it's alive it's 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 alive it's and it's overflowing with love nothing but love for you and and, and the divine and what you have going for yourself what you're building for yourself for some of you guys like i said working searching for something that that would bring meaning to your life right? With this uh, hermit energy. It's almost as if you're, you're lighting your whole life on fire. With with Look at this. Then you get a beautiful four of wands energy. But look, it's almost as if the darkest places of your life are being lit up. For some of you guys, it's emotional. Some of you guys, uh, again, living, uh, you fall out in the cold. For some of you guys, you guys lost people that really meant the world to you. For some of you guys, it was uh, friends, family, significant others. You 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 lost them, like lost, lost people, and uh, you guys died. Remember, when you lose somebody, part part of you dies with them, right? And so you were so sad, feeling at the Five of Pentacles for so long, but still moving forward when you had no reason to. You didn't even believe that there was anything out there for you. Some of you guys gave up. You guys never thought you'd be able to feel again or feel happy or feel just in general. And here you are. The divine surprises you, right? With this, you're at this pit stop and you light this motherfucker on fire and all the darkest places around you with the moon are lit up lit the fuck up and guess what you know what you found out that you're alive for some of you guys this was really hard like i said you did not think 
you would ever be able to feel again. Some of you guys are able to meditate. And at one point, you guys were not able to. I think some of you guys struggled with even being present in the moment. That's how much pain you guys were in. You weren't able to feel because every time you meditated or calmed down or, or, or heard stillness or quietness, you would cry. Some of you guys were crying for years. And now you're at a point where, where you can sit with, with, with the stillness of your, and the presence of just you and, and the outside. And you feel, you feel. Some of you guys are, are teaching your brain or reteaching yourself to not be scared of being present in the moment. Because for some of you guys, that pain was so bad. There was so much trauma. There was anxiety. There was fear. There was pain. All you ever felt was pain and fear, which triggered fear response, right? So then, so then therefore you couldn't sit and meditate because every time you did, you would cry. And now you're sitting there and yes, you may cry still, but it's almost as if you feel whole sane and alive again next you get the emperor with the empress this is what i'm saying for some of you guys you're the emperor you're, you're letting it be known that you're here and you and you're staking your claim in the land it's your land you took it back do you see what i'm saying you couldn't see shit but guess what you took that land back and it's yours and you, it has your name written over it and you're taking it and you're saying yes i'm back with confidence it is a miracle that i'm back but i'm back with this Empress energy, this is an invitation for you to start opening up and allowing yourself to have fun. And this is what you guys have been working tirelessly for. Some of you guys, it wasn't even just a passion project. It was, for some of you guys, it was emotionally opening up so you can feel again. Divine Feminine asking you, are you ready to let me in? Are you ready to open up? Are you ready to love again? Are you ready to feel like a kid again? Are you ready to explore life in, in ways that you never thought you could again. It was a miracle that you're okay. You got the seven of pentacles with the queen of pentacles in reverse, but I'm not really thinking bad. Look, look at the, look at the pentacles. It's almost as if it's saying you're, uh, um, you couldn't see, right? It's, 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 it's unclear, but it's an unveiling that's about to happen. It's an unveiling. If you see the circle, the rotation with the white, and unveiling that this road that you chose, even though you used to hate yourself for choosing this road, some of you guys were in pain and hated it and regretted it every second because for some of you guys, you've been doing this for years, maybe a decade, okay? I'm talking to those people here. You you thought that this road was going to lead nowhere and guess what? No, baby girl, miss, you're sadly mistaken, baby boy. This road is paved with gold. You just You're just about to see it unveil. You didn't think there was going to be anything there for you because of the, the loss or the sacrifice, the constant sacrifice, right? But no, you're sadly mistaken. Some of you guys are about to see financially invitations, emotional invitations, physical invitations, um, financial opportunities, all of that. And it's going to have a strong emotional implication into your life. It's going to mean something. And it's going to be positive and negative. Why? Because all of those emotions are wrapped into this one uh, pathway that you chose. You made this choice, not really, really realizing it was going to be this arduous. But now that you're here, you wouldn't have chosen it for any other. You wouldn't have wanted it any other way because you're already done with the pain. You're already done with the, with, the, with the pain. It's time to experience both the good and the bad. So these opportunities are going to bring so much, the highs and the lows all together, and it's going to be wrapped in one. But you know what's the best part of it? It's like you're not even looking at it as a bad thing. You're just looking at it as a whole experience, right? Because you actually get the opportunity to do it over again. That's what, that's the difference with the mindset. Before, you just wanted the highs. You didn't want to experience the lows. Now, because you've experienced it all, now you're, you're just grateful that you get to do it over. And now you're looking forward to it, all of it, because that's part of your journey. Congratulations, my beautiful fire signs. I love you.